Chris Algieri. Welcome to the Champion Lifestyle. Morning, Team Algieri. It's uh, Thursday morning. Got sparring tonight. I uh, just woke up it's pretty early. It's about uh, a little before 7. Uh, I like to wake up early, get a lot more done. Uh, I'm a lot more productive in the morning. Although today I'm feeling pretty unmotivated. Um, I got a bunch of computer work to do, some phone calls to make. Um, just trying to get myself together. But in the meantime, doing something a little a little more passive. It's just something for you guys to think about. If you're not feeling motivated, do more active stuff. Go and find some things that you can do that are passive. Check emails, things like that. And me, I'm actually watching um, some videos from my trainer, Tim Lane. He, um, he has been posting... Uh, videos to uh, a Dropbox account for me and has been, you know, posting them for me to to watch because he's in Las Vegas, so I get the chance to still train with him while, um, you know, he's across the country. You know, he need, we didn't have the opportunity for him to, to come out for this camp, uh, which I normally do, and I did last camp, and uh, I I do like to do that because it's it's great to have both my coaches in New York at the same time, but it's not always possible. So we devised this little plan that uh, he can still coach me, you know, even though he's in Vegas and, and I'm in New York with my other coach, Keith Trimble. So he posts videos pretty much every day um, going over the game plan about what, what we're going to do. Um, Tim is a master boxing coach and, you know, is, puts a lot of thought and strategy into it. He's really the strategy guy. You know, and, and and looks for the the perfect perfect fight and perfect strategy for for every opponent. He studies my my opponents. I don't really watch tape of my my opponents. Um, I always say you can't find rhythm watching tape, and boxing is all about rhythm. It's all about rhythm. Finding your your opponents, you know, timing and, and rhythm and um, watching tape's not really going to help you do that. You'll find some some you know some mistakes and things that, that people do wrong and, and and little tricks and things like that. But that's for my coaches to figure out and to tell me what to do. I'm not going to worry about that stuff. They, they'll they figure that out. Both my coaches are, are, are good at studying tape and, and figuring out the best way to win a fight. Um, you know, for me, I just got to go in there first round, figure out the guy's rhythm, find my defense, um, find their timing, you know, find my timing. Um, oh, if you don't know about this, this is this is yerba mate. This is uh, an herbal tea infusion. I drink it most days. Um, if, uh, I'll actually post a, a website that'll give you some information about the health benefits, uh, about Yerba Mate. Um, and if you guys want, if you guys, you know, post, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll actually do a video on it and talk, talk about it and maybe show you how to prepare it. It's a little tricky sometimes, but it's basically a South American herbal tea infusion. Um, uh, my mother was born in Argentina, so this is something that, uh, Argentines drink constantly, but, um, it is, it's delicious and it's, you know, it's it's kind of like a, like your morning coffee, you know. Co coffee makes me very jittery. I, I'm kind of sensitive to caffeine, but the matein that's in mate is uh, a, a little more mellow. But back to what we were talking about before. Um, back to my coach here. But yeah, I'm just you know taking the morning off, taking taking the morning light, looking studying studying right now. Um, rest is part of training too. I've said that before in other videos. At this point of training camp, um, I got to make sure I'm getting I'm getting my rest and, and and feeling good for all my boxing workouts. I have my last sparring session of the week tonight. So I want to make sure um, I'm feeling good, feeling sharp, and the game plan is fresh in the mind. So watching these videos, thinking about things, um, I like to uh, also I take I try and take a nap before all my sparring sessions. Um, it's twofold. One, it's it's to be well rested. You know, I do wake up early in the morning, so uh, an afternoon nap is is always a good thing. But also, it allows me to really focus on the session itself and get myself mentally prepared. Um, you know, sparring is 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 the most important part of training, I think. You know, I think if, if you, you take everything else out, that's really the, the number one thing because that's the closest thing to fight night that you you can get. So I take it very seriously, and every sparring session counts. You know, there's there's, there's not that many. I don't spar hundreds of rounds getting ready for a fight. I, I'd rather, um, you know, have more per less, less sessions and, and, and get good quality sessions with good quality guys and work on very specific things. So, uh, you know, I take that, that little nap and I take that time to, to visualize and see what the game plan is. And I visualize myself doing the things that uh, I, I should be doing and, and thinking about and that my coaches want me to do. And, and um, so I'm that prepared and get the most, you know, efficient work and, and, and progress from, from each session. But um, I'll check in a little bit later. 
probably before my sparring session, and I'll definitely check in after. Um, maybe I'll get even get get some some video uh, of the actual sparring session tonight. But um, in the meantime, you guys keep checking in. Champion Lifestyle, check it out. Check out the Team Algeria YouTube channel. And I'm going to go finish drinking my mate and sitting here with my coach, Tim Lane, watching videos and probably make some breakfast in a little bit. But, all right, guys, be good. What's up, Team Algeria? Just uh, finished up sparring. Uh, did some rounds with uh, another local prospect, 6-0, Richie Neves. It's good work tonight. Um, you know, he's a little bit of a heavier guy, so I had to work a little differently. Um, you know, had to box a little more. But I actually did work some of my inside work, you know, with a bigger guy because Richie's pretty good on the inside. So I wanted to work on my wrestling movement on the inside because that's something that could, that could possibly happen. Also, help me work my cardio a little bit, moving a bigger guy. But, um, no, it's definitely good work. I'm feeling good about uh, this week closing our sparring for the week. You know, this is our third session of the week. And um, definitely feeling good, feeling very positive and, and, and uh, making good progress moving towards uh, our fight July 20th, but um, about to go eat a turkey burger right now, um, that's what I do every Thursday night, it's, uh, it's a bit of a tradition, we go with the guys from the gym and um, call it Turkey Burger Thursday, so I'm going to uh, go get that, I'm going to go eat a whole bunch and uh, go to bed and I will see you guys tomorrow, alright?